Everybody, merge already! Merge! Why are you not merging? Yes. Oh, can't you wait to drive a car so that you can be in traffic? Oh, you will learn to hate the merge. Yes, merge. Well, it's used in different ways. This is an eighth grade word. It's a it's a verb. You can merge. Uh, you know, uh, so you can look at one. The second version here it says of a motor vehicle move from one lane into a gap into traffic into another lane. Okay, um, uh, it's a verb. You know, combine or cause to combine to form a single entity. All right, so merge two things together. You could merge like. Uh, I don't know, uh, milk and chocolate together to make some delicious chocolate milk, okay? All right, they've merged. <laughs> they've joined forces, all right? Maybe you have two military troops. They've merged. Uh, they merged with another troop, and now they're, they've joined forces, okay? Merge, okay? Uh, the rivers merge. Everything's merging. <laughs> uh, two roads in a in a in a yellow wood. Oh, they diverged. They diverged. They didn't merge. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, I guess in the reverse they merged. Yes. Um, so merge it means to absorb, to blend, to combine, incorporate, amalgamate. These are all synonyms. Remember synonyms similar. Eighth graders. All right. Uh, merge. Oh, the, the antonym. Well, disconnect. Okay. Uh, you know, I disconnected all of my cords from, from, from their, uh, iPhones. Okay. They're not merged anymore. All right. Um, so separate something like that. So remember, you will learn about merging, <laughs> uh, once you start driving, but it is a popular word. Merge. Uh, I didn't look at the history of it. Let me see if I can do that. Uh, history of merge. I don't want that. <laughs> Let's do this. Mergers and acquisitions. That means you you merge with a company. So a lot of companies will merge. Okay, and this will be one big gigantic company. Um, merge. Uh, what do I want? Merge etymology. Etymology, history of a word. So whenever I'm looking for the history of a word, I go to etymology. Okay. Merge, to plunge or to sink in. All right. We don't really use it that way. To, to dip in, to immerse, to plunge. All right. Well, to be swallowed up. <laughs> I guess that's true, right? So if you, if you merge two things together, I guess something does get swallowed up, right? Or it becomes one thing now. So I get why they, that, where that word came from. All right, from Latin, mergere. All right, there you go. Uh, practice. You could probably have dinner. You could probably merge two two uh, separate foods together to make a beautiful combination, a student food combination. All right, see you later. That's the word of the day. Bye.